Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So I'm super excited today because I'm going to be sharing with you my 10 top gift picks for this year, 2020. And man, it has been a year, but hopefully all of you will be able to enjoy a great holiday time with your friends and family. And these are just some of the gifts that I've been giving for years. Some of them are new and I haven't really checked out yet, but these are the gifts that I'm going to be giving this year. So I wanted to share with you guys some of my top 10 picks for these gift ideas. If that sounds at all interesting to you, definitely keep on watching. For those of you who might be new here, thanks so much for checking this out. I am a full-time working mom, but in my spare time, I really love making these videos on fashion, beauty, mommy lifestyle, in addition to my reselling experience as well. So if that kind of thing sounds at all interesting to you, definitely keep on watching. Check out my other videos linked down below, and also consider subscribing. It'll really, really help me out as well. Okay, so for today I wanted to share with you guys my 10 top gift picks for this year and I'm going to be including some favorites that I've been giving every year so far in addition to some new items that to be honest I haven't even checked out before but items that I'm going to be giving this year. In case you're curious about my gift picks from last year, 2019, I've linked that video down below. And in this video, I have not repeated any of those particular items. I wanted to kind of give you some new ideas. However, those items I mentioned last year are still some of my favorites, so definitely check those out for some other gift ideas in case you're interested. Okay, so I'm going to be covering gifts for everyone in the family, so for women, men, kids, uh, home gifts, in addition to teacher gifts and coworker gifts as well. So I've only included one or two items in each of those categories, just so this video isn't too lengthy, and I only wanted to include 10 picks just to kind of limit my options a little bit. I will be giving, obviously, other gifts besides these, but these are some of my top 10 for this year. So I'm going to go ahead and just jump into my top pick for women this year. And of course, this is probably my most favorite category to shop for, obviously. I often shop for myself in addition to shopping for some of my friends and family who are women. So um, I really, really love this category. So I have one amazing gift pick for women this year, and it's from the line Cozy Earth. And this line has been featured as Oprah's favorite things for I think three years running now. And they make amazing bamboo products for sleep, including amazing sheets, pajamas, and loungewear. I was first introduced to this company um, by my friend who just gifted me this set I'm about to show you, and I've just fallen in love. So I will definitely be gifting this to other people who I love as well. So this line is amazing because they're into fair trade practices. In addition to helping you get better sleep and lifestyle by regulating your body temperature in terms of their sheets and a lot of their loungewear as well. So really a company to check out that I was just recently honestly introduced to this year. And just to get this out there to remind Mind you, this whole video, of course, is not sponsored. I did not have any of these items gifted to me. I purchased all of these or was gifted these items personally. And hopefully in that way, I can give you a truly unbiased opinion in some of these amazing gift picks. Okay, so let me just show you these Cozy Earth products. And the first is this jogger set that I received that is just amazing. So here is what the packaging comes like. So it says Cozy Earth. And each of the items come like this in their baggie. And this is a particular jog set. So it's the crew neck, also the jogger, in this beautiful bamboo fabric. And because it has bamboo, also similar to a lot of the Barefoot Dreams bamboo infused products, um, it's super, super soft. And these days, of course, all of us are lounging more and more at home. So these items are just perfect to give for this season. Here's what the crew neck black sweatshirt looks like. It's just a basic black sweatshirt, as you can see here. But it's just so soft and luxurious against your skin. Um, here's what the tag looks like, in case you're curious. Just this cozy earth. And I have a size medium. So just so you know, in these type of loungewear pajama sets, I tend to size up. So typically on a retail, I'm about a size small, but in these kind of loungewear pajamas, I tend to go up to medium because I really, really want a little bit of an oversized fit. So medium fit me just perfectly for the kind of fit I was looking for. I would say in general, these do run true to size. If you want kind of a true to size loungewear pajama set, I probably would stick to your true size, but if you want a little bit of oversized look, you can size up like I did. And then the second item here is the joggers. So let me just quickly show you these. Again, they come in the same packaging here. So really nice gift presentation, I think. You just have to put it in a beautiful bag or box and throw a ribbon on it and you're good to go. And here is what the joggers look like. So it's a very classic jogger. It has the elasticized waistband with the pull drawstring here. And at the bottom, it's the jogger bottom at the end where it tapers off and it has a little bit of a banding at the 
cuff there. And they do come with pockets, both side seam pockets in the front. And there is also one slip pocket in the back as well, which is pretty generous, as you can see here, which is also nice. Even though I'm having this as my gift pick for women this year, they also make a men's line, and I probably will be gifting one of these to my husband as well, um, because all of us spend time at home these days. This is the perfect gift, especially for this year. So definitely check out these lounge sets from Cozy Earth, in addition to their pajamas and sheets and all the other beautiful products they have as well. Okay, so the next item that I wanted to share with you all is something that I think is good for men. So men is probably the hardest category that I shop for. So I just have no idea what to get my brother, my dad, my in-laws, or my uh, husband. I think it's just so challenging to shop for men because, of course, the men in my life have everything they need. They love electronics typically, but they don't want me to purchase any electronics for them, that's for sure. So it's just hard to get some ideas. So check out my video last year for gift ideas. I had a couple of thoughts that I wanted to share with you guys. In terms of good gift ideas for men but besides those options this year I'm going to consider giving this gift to some of the men in my life so what it is is a very simple just very affordable product but it's from this line or brand clip hanger and what this is is it's really a hanger and a ring for your phone or any type of device so again everybody these days are using devices more and more and this will work, I believe, on any type of tablet or even your phone. So for instance, currently I have this eye ring on my iPhone, as you can see here. And what's nice about it is it has a little ring. So if I want to be carrying it around, I can just put my finger in it like this and talk on the phone. It minimizes my chance of dropping the phone because it's attached to your finger, which is amazing. So the other nice thing about these little eye rings is it acts as a little bit of a kickstand. So it can stand up as well if you're watching something on your phone. It allows you to have a little bit of kickstand. So I know there are so many products like this out there but I really like this ring version I think it's a sturdy version it allows you to have a kickstand in addition to a really secure way of holding your phone so similar to this concept I found this year this item called the clip hanger let me just show you what it looks like so as you can see here it's basically an eye ring like I just showed you it has the ring here so it does all those features where you can put your finger on it attach it to your phone and use it as a kickstand, all those features. But the nice thing about this one is it has a little clip on it as well. So if you attach it to your phone, you can use it like a ring, but you also can use it like a little clip. So this clip here can attach on different things. So it just goes off like this and goes back on. And you're able to use this as a little hook for your phone, which I thought was so cool. And I believe you can even twist it down. So if it's attached to your phone, you don't want it hanging out, you can twist it down so that it's not sticking out and it's just streamlined on the back of your phone. But if you want a hook on your phone for any reason, um, you have a little hook. So it'll look something like this on the top of your phone. So that's super convenient. You can hang it anywhere. Um, you can hang it on your purse, on your bag. If you're out shopping, you can hang it on certain places to keep it attached so you will always have your phone at the ready so I think this is a really cool little attachment to the typical ring that I love using on my phone so I thought this kind of little gadget gift for guys is just really perfect because it's nothing too extravagant but just a really fun gift would make an amazing stocking stuffer as well so next category of gift ideas I wanted to share with you all are items for kids and if you've been watching my channel for any amount of time you'll know that I have four young kids all under the age of eight so in our house so this time of year is super special I just love seeing the holidays through their eyes it just makes it so so meaningful and I really love spoiling them with little gifts during the holidays so these will be a few of the ideas that we're going to share with our kids this year but of course they're going to be getting other things as well especially gifts from Santa which I won't disclose um, because I don't know what Santa's going to give them but um, these are items that we're just going to gift to them from ourselves so I I'm going to share with you a couple of fun gift picks. So the first one is this item called a dream pillow and here's what the packaging looks like in case you're curious. And if these items are still available I will of course try to link them down below so you can check them out for yourself if you're interested. But this particular item is a really cool little product. My older kids are going through the phase of thinking more about dreams and occasionally, unfortunately, having the typical nightmares and kind of thinking about what dreams are and what they mean and what they could mean. So as they've been starting to kind of verbalize these things, I thought a dream pillow like this might be a good idea, especially for these ages. So what it is, is it's a little pillow and you get different versions. And I got several of these in different versions for my kids, in addition to my nephew as well. But it's a little pillow like this. Look at how cute this is. This one 
I think is a little lamb. And it's a little pillow with, it's kind of like a hand warmer essentially. There's a hole in the middle here. But they can sleep on this pillow. And what the neat thing about this dream pillow is, is it comes along with a whole tablet or pad of note paper. And it says, my dream wish for tonight is... So it comes along with this cute note paper. And what the child does is they write on there what their dream will be for that evening. And they go ahead and put it inside the pillow and they can sleep on it. So the idea is they hopefully will go to bed thinking of good thoughts and have good dreams as well. So this is kind of a creative gift I thought that I just don't see everywhere that I thought might be good for the ages of my kids that they are now. And it also, of course, comes with a little Dream Animals book here. And it has a little pocket to store your favorite dream cards here. And it also has a little bit of a book about the animal that you've received. So this is Lammy, this is a little lamb. And you know, it goes over a cute little book about Lammy as well. So I really love these book products combined with a little fun stuffed item. I think it's perfect for this age group. And just the idea of engaging your children a little bit more in the bedtime routine I thought was a really, really unique item. So I'm really, really interested in seeing how the kids will like this, but it's called a dream pillow. So I really, really like Melissa and Doug products, as I'm sure you've heard about from this channel and seen before. Um, I think they make really amazing, good quality, often wooden or really nice material products that last the test of time. And oftentimes their products are very educational and encourage thought and creativity as well, which I really, really am a fan of, of course, too. So this year for my two-year-old, I decided to pick up this item and it's from Melissa and Doug. It's a beauty salon playset. And there's a little mirror here, so I don't want to blind you, but it's the little playset here from Melissa and Doug. As you can see here, it's a really adorable wooden playset here, and it has essentially a vanity. It has makeup on here, it has some brushes, it also has um, blow dryer, lotions, you know, things like that that she's just going to love. So she's starting to get into that age where she's starting to get interested in seeing mommy put on her makeup and get ready in the morning. So she's just going to love playing around with this. And of course, none of these are real products either. It's not really plain makeup at all. It's just completely wooden products that are not really functional, which I think is perfect for her. So it's going to be an amazing item, I think, for a two-year-old. So we'll see how she loves this. I almost have no doubt that she's going to love this. But check out other Melissa and Doug products. I think they always make really, really great gift ideas as well. So my next top gift pick for kids this year is an item that I'm sure you're going to see everywhere this season, and that's the child from The Mandalorian. And as soon as I saw this really, really cute baby Yoda, I knew that Disney had it down right, because I knew that the merch would be everywhere because how adorable he is. So of course I had to add this to my gift pick list for this year, and I actually just got this on Amazon. It was still available, but I do think this stuff may sell out because I know how popular he is. Um, so I was happy I got my hands on this, and I picked up a couple of these as well. And as you can see here, I got just the plush version of the child. So here's what he looks like. I mean, how can you resist that face, right? So this is just the plush version. I think it'll be fun for my kids to kind of cuddle up with him. Um, the body, I believe, is soft, yes. And then the head, of course, is a more firm type of material. So this is hopefully going to be for my older kids. But I thought this was just adorable. I could not pass it up. I've seen so many versions of this, though. They have ones that actually interact with your children, if you're interested in that kind of item, and other types of merchandise as well. So, I mean, this has to be on your gift pick list if you have kids around the ages of mine. So definitely something to check out, I would say. Okay, so I have one final gift pick for kids this year, and it's a very classic traditional gift, and that's a family game. And every, well, ideally week in our home, but usually it's about every month these days, we try to do a family game night. And I think it's really important to kind of reconnect with your family, to play games with your kids, to engage them with the games. And a lot of these games are really educational and teaches them a lot of life skills as well. So we do try to incorporate games into our evening routines whenever we can. So there are a lot of amazing family games out there, of course. I have so many favorites. But one of my ultimate favorites is this game, Pie Face, which you probably have seen around before. It's a pretty classic game, I would say, by now. But what's really fun about it is you add whipped cream here, and when you're playing the game, if you essentially lose, you get pied in the face. So there's a picture of it. 
These kind of games are just perfect for them because they love this kind of humor, I would say. I've given this game so many times for gifts and everyone that receives it really, really enjoys it. So I think this is a great pick for gifts for the season for your little ones. But if you're not necessarily interested in this particular game, there are so many other amazing games out there. But I think giving the gift of a game in general to a family is just a perfect gift when you have young kiddos like I do. Okay, so I just wanted to share with you now two of my top picks for home or family gifts. So I have two amazing ones, pretty classics in my gift arsenal, I would say. And the first is from the line Barefoot Dreams. So I've talked about Barefoot Dreams so many times on this channel. I have done a whole video on Barefoot Dreams, including my review of their fabrications and different items that I will link down below as well in case you're curious. But I always give Barefoot Dreams every single year, not just for the holidays, but throughout the entire year. So in last year's gift pick list, I did include Barefoot Dreams, but I talked more about their loungewear and cardigans to give as gifts, which I think still make amazing gifts. But if you want to give a gift to a family or household, I think the perfect gift, of course, would be the Barefoot Dreams throws or blankets. So here's the example of the one I picked up this year, and you probably saw this in my Nordstrom anniversary sale, which I picked this up at this year. But I just love this particular fabrication. So this is the throw, it's in Cozy Chic, and it's called the Loop Throw. So the unique thing about this particular throw, different than the other Barefoot Dreams throws that I have, is this little loop texture. So it's this really, really cool loop texture that makes it extra cozy in my opinion. And on the other side, as you'll see, it's this really nice straight pattern, which definitely has a little bit more of a streamlined type of loft. So this particular blanket has been so cozy, especially this time of year. My daughter just loves it and tries to steal it off of our bed every single night. So I think this is just a unique Barefoot Dreams blanket. Even for the Barefoot Dreams lover that may have a lot of other Barefoot Dreams blankets, I thought this texture was pretty unique. So I think this is a great gift idea for the home. Just perfect for anyone, adults, kids, just anyone in your life. So just really, really can't say enough good things about this particular throw. Okay, so the second gift idea that I have this year for the home or for the family is the gift of fragrance. So I have here my little Nest candle that I picked up a couple years ago in some gift sets. And as you can see, it's just beautiful. It has some gold foiling on it. But really why I love this particular candle is the scent. So this is the holiday scent. And as I said before in my previous videos, this is the scent of the holidays in my home. I buy this every single year. This is my most favorite scent by far, even above higher end luxury candles. I just prefer this scent. I think it's a perfect mix of holiday fragrances. So this is an amazing gift idea, I would say, for a gift that you're looking for for families or really anyone, I'd say women or men as well. So definitely a top gift pick for sure every single year. And this year the holiday boxes are so beautiful. So as you can see I picked up two items already from the Nest Line holiday season this year. And here is what the box looks like. So it says Nest and the fragrance is holiday. And this one I picked up from the Sephora VIB holiday sale. And this pack up here includes beautiful candle, which is the same size I have burning here from years past, and a beautiful reed diffuser. So in our household, we use both of these. I love burning candles, but with little kids around, it's not always practical, nor do I want to burn it all day. So I often love this reed diffuser for that reason. This just stays open the whole season. It lasts for almost six months in our household, which is amazing. So throughout the whole season, you're able to have this beautiful holiday fragrance. So I think this is a perfect gift pack up that I picked up from Sephora, but it's sold elsewhere as well. And then this year, I also just purchased this from Nordstrom, and it's the same holiday candle because I'm just in love with it, but I did pick up the larger three-wick version. So I think either of these items would make just an amazing gifts. So as you can see, the packaging is just gorgeous, and the three-wick candle is just spectacular. They also did make a luxury side, which wasn't available, I think, at the time. But look at this, it's huge. <laughs> this would definitely last me the whole season, I would say. And as you can see here, the packaging, again, is that typical holiday packaging for the season. And the patterns on the vessels here change from year to year. So you can kind of collect these different uh, glass vessels here. And in case you're curious about the notes of the holiday scent, according to the packaging here, it just says there's a blend of pomegranate, mandarin orange, pine, cloves, and cinnamon with a hint of vanilla and amber. So those fragrances combined, in my opinion, just make the perfect holiday scents. So this Nest Holiday Candle is definitely a favorite of mine to give and receive every single year, hands down. 
So I have two more gift picks for you all, and the next category is gifts for teachers. So as you can imagine, with four kids at home, I have a lot of teachers' gifts to give. Each child has at least three teachers, in addition to a lot of other support staff or teachers that we also want to gift a little something to every year. So it definitely adds up. So I can't go crazy with their holiday gifts every single year, but we do like to acknowledge them and all the hard work that they do for our kids every year. So this has been a favorite of ours for many years running now, and it's this beautiful gift set that I always pick up. It's it's a set of caramel apples that are just amazing and decked out for the holidays as you can see here. So it's from the line Mrs. Printables and it's a set of 10 apples as you can see but each of them comes individually gift box in an adorable Christmas package. So I think the presentation is just spectacular. All the apples are really fresh, amazing quality. They have caramel dipped in chocolate and often has some combination of toffee or M&Ms or some type of holiday sprinkle on them as you can see here. So they're just delicious is number one they're huge I think they're somewhat unique because caramel apples I think are a little bit more unique than a typical I guess box of chocolates I'd say during the holidays but what I would say is the best thing about these gifts is that it comes in these adorable individual Christmas boxes as you can see here they're just perfect for teachers they oftentimes will have kind of a little bit of a kitty design as you can see here as well so I think perfect for elementary school teachers and daycare teachers so in addition to this item what we do is we attach a little gift card on it as well to either a restaurant or a coffee house that we like that year so that's what we're gonna be doing this year again gift cards in addition to um, a really cute, uh, really yummy, I'd say delicious caramel apple as well. So I think this is a great teacher's gift idea. And then the final gift idea I have is gifts for coworkers. And this is always a tough category for me because similarly, I have a lot of coworkers to give gifts to. I have both a whole cohort of coworkers I work with in the hospital setting, which is different from the whole cohort of people that I work with in my clinic setting. In addition to a lot of, of course, support staffs, nurses, medical assistants, a lot of people that you want to recognize during the holidays. So again, those are a lot of people and it really adds up. So I can't go crazy with each individual gift but I like to give just a thoughtful, personal little gift during the holidays to recognize everyone. So this year what I thought would be fun is this item from Mark and Graham. I've never purchased anything from this company before, so let me know if you have. I get a lot of their mailers and I just kind of toss them aside, but this year I said, well, let me take a look a little more closely. And they have some really, really nice products and most importantly, you can personalize them, which is what I really liked about it. So I think I'm going to purchase these and kind of see how they go. This was the Black Friday deal. I'm not sure if it's still available now, but they always have some kind of promotion or deals. So as you can see here, it's a USB keychain attached to a lightning cable. So essentially, it's an iPhone charger attached to the USB. So why I think this is perfect for the workplace is everyone is always asking to borrow your iPhone charger. All of us in general have iPhones at work. So this is perfect because then everybody will have their own charger. It's attached to a keychain and you can monogram it. So I'm going to be um, doing a slight upcharge to monogram every item for people and you can put their initials on there in gold foiling. So I think this would be just perfect for the workplace because everyone will know exactly whose charger is whose so they won't get mixed up and I think it's just a really nice personalized gift and as much as possible during the holidays I like to try to give some kind of personalized gift to people because I think it just shows that you thought about them specifically. It's not just a generic gift you picked off the shelf but you actually spend some time thinking about what they may like and spend some time thinking ahead to make that perfect personal gift. So items like these monogram items are ones that I really try to gravitate toward during the holidays. I really hope this works out for me. I will let you know in future videos what I think about these products, but I'm definitely going to be giving this uh, for the holidays to my coworkers this year. So that does it. Those are my top 10 holiday gift ideas for this year, holiday 2020. So I hope you enjoyed this video and got a few ideas of some items that I'm loving giving for the holidays and items that you might want to consider purchasing for yourself as well. So most importantly, I want to wish you and your family an amazing and safe holiday season. I know it's been a really rough holiday and all of our holidays are going to look different this year compared to other years. But the main thing is that you have your health and you are able to spend some time with loved ones, even if it is virtually. That's the most important part of this time of year. So I hope you're able to really enjoy and cherish these moments with everyone. Thank you so much for all of your support over the past couple years I've been here on YouTube as well. I can't thank you enough. And I'm so appreciative of all the support and feedback you all give me for all of these videos and stick with me through these as well. So thank you again for another amazing year too. I hope you all take care and enjoy this season and I will see you again in my next video. Bye!